Good morning, you guys. Today is Friday. It's the day after a very long work night for me, so. And it's raining. I'm in survival mode this morning, y'all. Whenever I work, and I have to work late like I did last night, then the next day is like, oh my gosh, kind of rough, but I will get there. But right now, we are trying out a new breakfast recipe. We are trying out berry breakfast bread pudding. So, hello Barney Toy. Thank you for serenading us. <laughs> so here is what we're making. You want it? You want your Barney toy? <gasps> oh, yes. Awesome. You gonna kiss it? You love it that much, huh? <laughs> Sounds like the batteries might be going dead. All right, so Mason is gonna help me out. Maddie's gonna help me out. She's got the eggs. Don't bust the eggs. <laughs> All right, so this is a lot like any breakfast casserole where you shred the you shred the bread, you put it down, you mix, um, you do like berries, and then you mix like some egg milk and spices, so that's what we're gonna do. Look, I'm Chef Boyardee. You look great, Chef Boyardee. and this tray for like an hour of some uh, you know UV rays outside well apparently when my timer went off I did not bring them in so I noticed this morning it's pouring the rain the trays are filled with water and I, I remembered that I never brought these in and so these guys these poor plants were out all day yesterday and all night so the squash plants look fine. I think they're fine. They're going to be just fine. <laughs> they took a little bit of a beating with the heavy rain um, and, you know, extended periods of UV. But these guys, the only thing I've noticed with these were some yellowing on the leaves. And uh, that is really just like a sunburn from, you know, getting too much sunlight. They're not used to that. So... Anyway, it's kind of sad. I forgot about them, but I'm sure they'll make a full recovery inside. So there they are. My tomato plants were under the grow light all night. So I'm just, I'm going to not have them under the light right now. Probably need to just put them back in the, in the cabinet. These smell so good. The tomato plants smell so good. They're doing fine. Oh, look at your pretty skirt. I Mama. like that. Mama. What? You have a bottle? Mom, hmm? this is my piggy bank. Oh, you have a piggy bank? 
my new picky ring. Mm. And you can carry it around because I have a little Yeah, but remember you're supposed to leave stuff like that in your room, Missy. I know, I'll just, I'll put it back in my room. So I have one dollar bill for sleeping in my bed. Okay, why did you get that one dollar bill? For sleeping in my bed. All night? Yes. Yes. And this is the bed that's beside Mommy and Daddy's bed, but we're still having to do some pretty big incentives to get her to sleep in her bed <laughs> all night. This dollar stick at the bottom of so, And I have another dollar because I slept um, again. So I have two dollars so far. So the one dollar bill seems to be a good ex uh, yeah. incentive, right? But, yes, and every night I'll get a dollar and I just can buy some toys. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just save it for something really nice like a trip to the beach? Then you can have money to spend at the beach. Oh, I need to buy a toy at the beach. <laughs> I'm going to take this to school for presentation this week. Oh. And guess what? Next week is our last day of school for summer. Yep, and then we've got to finish our other yeah. work here, huh? Yeah, and guess what? It's like mom is wants to like have like a little pool day. Yeah, like over the summer, have your friends over for the yeah, pool? Like, th these are my friends Hadassah, Abby, Sin. What is her name? Sydney. Sydney. And I keep forgetting your name because it's like Sin. Cece? Like Cindy. Sydney. I know. It's like, I keep forgetting it. And then, like, Ollie's name, like, I say Ollie, and he's like, fun, Mr. Is he's like, Mr. Ollie. I keep <laughs> All right, so the next thing we're going to make is some pizza dough for lunch or dinner, probably for lunch. So all I did was I went on to Pinterest, just pulled up a bread machine pizza dough recipe. Um, basically, it's two cups of flour, tablespoon of butter, tablespoon of sugar, teaspoon of yeast, teaspoon of salt, um, a half a plus a half a cup plus two tablespoons of water, um, and that's it. So. We're going to put it on the dough setting and we're going to make our pizza dough in the bread machine. We're getting ready to go tackle the rest of our homeschool. I am also really, for some reason, motivated today, even though I didn't get a lot of sleep. And I am vacuuming out all of the couches. I have washed um, a lot of the cushions that had some stains. I didn't really feel like I needed to wash all the cushion covers, but some of them I, you know, decided to. Um, they did have a few stains on them, but I love these couches because there's no crevices everything is just you know covered so any dirt or crumbs get in here you can easily vacuum it out and yeah so i'm loving the ease of cleaning these couches so washing some of the cushion covers they are air drying now and it's time for school let's go to school can i have to go to school i'm working on a project okay mm -hmm. i like projects mm -hmm. is it a project i'm gonna like I should say it's a Nerf gun. A Nerf gun? That's not a project. Oh, but it's my Are you building thing. a Nerf gun? Yes. Oh, that's a project. All right. So it's going to be a Nerf gun with bolts, but, it's, but I made it. But you're going to make it? Yes. You're confused, ain't you? Mm-hmm. <laughs> and the river's running by, the sunset in the morning that brightens up the sky. The cold wind in the winter the pleasant summer sun, the ripe fruits in the garden, he made them every one. The tall trees in the greenwood, the rivers where we, oh sorry, the meadows where we play, the rushes by the water to gather every day. He gave us eyes to see them and lips that we might tell how great is God Almighty who has made all Genesis 4, 2-3. 
through 12. After that, Eve gave birth to Cain's brother Abel. Abel took care of sheep and Cain became a farmer. Later, Cain brought a gift to God. He brought some food from the ground. Abel brought the best God part knew of what Cain had done. He punished Cain because he was not sorry and did not tell him the truth about what happened. God told Cain that he would have a difficult time growing vegetables because of his sin. Cain also became a wanderer, living, never living in one place for very long. If you have done something wrong, tell God you are sorry and ask him to forgive you. He always will. Father God, please let me always do the things that make you happy. When I make mistakes, let me know that you love and forgive me. Amen. So it's always best to choose to live, God. Master, Master, he cried, they are come, they are come. Robinson jumped up and ran from his tent. His eyes searched the sea and came upon a boat about three miles out, but the boat was not coming from the mainland. Come back, Friday, he called. These are not the people we are expecting. We do not know if they are friends or enemies. Robinson immediately went for his spyglass. I almost forgot to show you guys our pizza we're having for lunch. So here is the homemade pizza dough. Yeah. We made some homemade pizza sauce. I did bake the um, pizza crust just for like five minutes prior to putting on the sauce. Just because I wanted to get make sure that it got nice and done. So we're going to put a little more sauce on. Whoops. We can eat it. Like mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. I always like to take take the topping off and just eat the sauce. Mm -hmm. I am sauteing some onion and some red bell pepper. I'm going to make a half and half. Half kid friendly, half mom and dad friendly. Pizza. That is where the bubble, the cheese bubbled up. So we're gonna let it cool off a little bit, and then we're gonna slice it why and is, give it a try. Why is this bigger than that? Huh? Why is this one bigger than that? It's just the way it baked up. But she looks so pretty. All right, we're finally trying out this hand mold thing that Mason got for Christmas. Nope. And. I have no idea how it's gonna work out. Yeah, and he so, might be there for a few weeks. Yeah. He's gonna hold his hand in there. Don't move. Uh, uh. Is your hand just flat like that? Mm -hmm. So you gotta hold it there till ever it till it hardens up, and then we'll mix the casting stuff, and then you pour it in, yeah. and then you make like a cast mold out of your hand. Uh, are so, you sure about this? <laughs> this is supposed to be hardening up. Is it hardening up? A little bit. A little. Yeah. I told him he might be here for a few weeks. Wait, really, really? So just get comfortable. Don't move a lot. Look at this. Interesting. It's not yellow, guys. <laughs> Is it gonna work? And I'm sad because I only for one hand. It's his. It's one hand, one person, one, one mold. Uh, Don't I move got, too much, baby. Two Turn more. around. So guys, this is what the thing looks so far. It's really cool. And it's gonna look a little funky. Mama, look, it's actually on. It's, so this is what it looks like so far. And it's really cool. Mm. I almost it up. <laughs> Mason. <laughs> Only sit there for a minute. So we're gonna leave it there for how many minutes, Mom? How many minutes are we going to wait it for? Until we, don't, we don't know. An hour? An hour. An hour. 
we're gonna, leave, we're gonna leave it for Alexa, an hour. Set a timer for 60 minutes. We're gonna leave it for 16 minutes. Yes. 16 minutes. <laughs> We're going to leave it for 60 minutes. So, guys, Mom is getting ready to leave for work. She's just over there. Hang on. She's going to come. And 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, and... I knew it! <laughs> huh? Mom, I'm actually videotaping. <laughs> I'm videotaping, though. Mom, I actually am videotaping. Look. Alright. So there she is. Mason. Dad. What's up, man? I actually am videotaping. Look.